A badge exodus, or is it bogus? This week on Sunrise, we've reported on cops calling it quits. This is happening all over the country. Police departments are having trouble keeping full staff. A survey by the Police Executive Research Forum shows three out of every four departments report declining applications over the last five years. The Los Angeles Police Department reports a shortage of 500 police officers. New Orleans says it's down at 300 from last year. Police officials say the drop in officers is a result of multiple issues, including burnout and low morale. Nationwide, studies show police staffing is down by 3%, resignations up by 42% last year. So what about those who protect and serve the Coastal Bend? I checked in with the departments of Aransas Pass, Corpus Christi, Robstown, Bishop. Overall, they're fine on staffing, but it is a competitive market. Some officers jump ship to another because of things like yeah, morale and pay. These days, they aren't all rushing through that open door of opportunity. Part of the reason is green. So pay is a huge thing that some agencies around us have as an incentive to attract that type of officer from up north or wherever they're trying to get them from into our area here. Don't get it wrong, there isn't an officer shortage in the coastal bend, but that doesn't mean departments haven't taken L's. The losses that we're experiencing more recently come down to financial loss. It's the pay, Chief Eric Blanchard says. At his department, the patrol officer rate is $21.25 an hour. Bishop officers make at least $17.79 an hour. In Robstown, starting pay is $18.50. All chiefs tell me they hope to raise those figures. You're not going to get rich doing it, but it's fulfilling to know that you can go out there and protect others and serve. And there's men and women that do it every single day with honor. The objective hasn't changed, but the job has over the years. Also, its reputation in some places, which can cause officers to walk away. I would urge other agencies, don't just get wrapped up in the national issue that we're all experiencing, the, the negativity and stuff like that surrounding law enforcement on a nationwide level. But look internally at your culture. Is there something failing within the department? So to be clear, all of these agencies, they have few, if any, positions to fill right now, but recruiting and retention can be a challenge. So this statement given to me by Corpus Christi senior officer Gina Reichert, she says in part their only vacancies are related to natural attrition. That's a term that can refer to retirement or resignation and that they actively recruit to fill those vacancies. Starting pay at this department is at about $28 an hour.